But right now, who's ever on Walter Clayton, he does not get to go to his right hand, for God's sake. If he beats us, he's got to go off the dribble inside the line to his left, please. Samuel's got the miss. Stan, what you're talking about is a defensive thing, and we haven't seen very many defensive things in this game. Clayton tries to split and drive. Hey, look, guys, I can't take it over here as a coach. You switched on to the guy. Get over on his right hand. O'Brien just picked up his fifth foul. He is gone for the Buffaloes. And the other thing is, Cody Williams is standing right there. Move your feet and try to get in front of him. Don't just reach your hand and wave at him as he goes by. I just, look, and this isn't just tonight. This is on every level. It is tough to guard guys off the dribble, but you can't let them go to their strong hand every time down the floor. Javon Ruffin will check in. Clayton hits it. He has the last nine points for Florida. Well, we were talking about how he had to be in the game because he can score. Here we go. De Silva looking, feeding Williams back to De Silva. That's who I want with the ball, the Silva and Simpson. And Simpson's got it. And into Williams. That's a nice job by Florida collapsing on Williams. He had a lane to the basket for a brief second. Simpson doubled. De Silva on top. And Shot not clock even trying to attack. They got to now. It's Simpson with the move in the paint. Oh, what a play! That's what Simpson does. He makes big plays in clutch situations. Well, at least they made him go to his left. Three, Clayton, in and out. Rebound inside, picked up by Kugel. On top, pulling. On the win, three, Clayton, good! Three-point game! What a shot! 29 for Walter Clayton. Timeout in Indy. The Gators are out of timeouts, but they've come to within three of the Colorado Buffaloes. Well, and they, they've got plenty of time here, Kevin. They don't have to foul, and I don't know if they want to foul the way Colorado's shooting the ball. But they can apply the pressure, and they can get a steal. Yeah, listen, I'm not fouling here. I, I'm not fouling. This team's too good at the free throw line. You're going to stay with that press. You know that Colorado is going to run the clock all the way to the end, but that's going to make them take a difficult shot. If you can get the rebound, sprint it up the floor, you probably can get a look at the three unless Colorado's smart enough to foul late in the game. And we've, already, we've already seen Colorado turn it over once against this pressure. The silver will inbound. Full court pressure, as you can see, and it goes quickly right there to Ruffin. Doubled. It's intercepted. It's intercepted by Kugel. The Gators have it down by three. Pulling outside on top. It's Clayton. The drive hard into the silver. Foul. What an interception by Kugel. Well, the ball got to Ruffin instead of the more accomplished ball handlers like De Silva, Cody Williams, and obviously Simpson, and they made him make a play, and they've been so passive against this pressure. This is one of the best free throw shooters in the country, Walter Clayton. Well, he's put on a show here, and I give Williams credit. At least he made him go to his left. <laughs> De Silva, De Silva picks up his fourth foul in 22 seconds to go. Hits this free throw one-point game. Oh, and he misses. Ruffin has the rebound. They swarm in with Hulk. Williams, the freshman. And a foul from behind on Thomas Hulk of Florida. 14.7. And it's obviously they're over the, over the limit, so it's going to be a two-shot foul. Well, I'll tell you what, you do not leave Walter Clayton Jr. Even if somebody else takes a shot and misses, you stay home. You don't even go to the rebound. You stay home on him, particularly if Williams only makes one of two. Cody Williams is now four of six. Now he's got to make. 
You know, to make it a three-point game, he's got to make the second one. And the second one, after you miss that one, the first one in this situation is much harder. Florida is out of timeouts. I'll tell you what, if he doesn't make this one, they're going to have a hard time guarding Tyrese Samuel inside. Three-point game. They're going to go back to the bench and bring in Dak. Well, that's how they're going to try to guard Samuel inside, I guess, right? They're going to guard Samuel with Hadley. Okay. Because you're not going to put the silver on him with four fouls. Please guard. Clayton's a tie. Good! Good! Nine point five. Timeout, Colorado. That is an incredible shot from deep by a guy who has been unbelievable down the stretch. Well, look how long this shot is. I mean, Simpson's guarding him, and he's, you know, he's been so good at going by. But in this situation, you only guard the three. And that's against pressure. Yeah, now listen, the only thing I would say there is I'd get on his right hand on that situation. He's over on his left side and leaving him free to shoot the ball with that right hand. It was deep. I'm nitpicking a little bit, but in that situation, you've got to be over on his strong hand. Clayton's got 33. A new career high. Two years at Iona. Played high school football in Florida and high school basketball. A two-time state champion. And my goodness, what steely nerves. Well, since they put him back in the game with those four fouls, it's like he's the only one who scored. But, Stan, I agree with you 100%. Florida took their foot off the gas too early. Yeah, Colorado. Colorado, Colorado excuse me. They did. I, I think, and now they've got six seconds. You want the ball in Simpson's hands here to make a play. The Gators on a 19-6 run. Colorado will inbound. 6.1 to go in regulation. Pullen will be on Simpson. Kugel on De Silva. I like the matchups. Yeah, Kugel's so athletic, he can probably guard De Silva. Williams to inbound. Simpson with it for the lead. Oh, oh! 1.7. 1.7. Long shot. Good at the guys. This is an incredible shot. He gets away with a little push off there. But you just had said it, Dan. This guy makes big shots. But he made big plays in the, the first four game. I mean, he has struggled, but he made a big basket at the end, made big passes. This is his reputation. He is a clutch player and no more clutch than right there. And first team all pack 12 KJ Simpson puts it in and the Buffaloes have won their second straight NCAA tournament game. Winning in the first four and winning here in round one. Kevin, and I'll give you a little stat. This is the first time that Colorado has won two games in the same NCAA tournament since 1955. Let's send it over to Andy Katz. Wow. All right, KJ, that ball bounced, bounced, and finally dropped in. As you were about to shoot it, what kind of vision did you have on that basket? Uh, I was looking to just be aggressive and drive, maybe draw a foul. Uh, saw the defender got off balance. That's a shot I shoot a bunch of times. It was nothing but repetition. And, you know, once I saw it bounce up a little bit, uh, I, was, I, was, I was hoping it went in. But when it went in, man, it's just amazing. You know, I got my mom here and everything. My dad watching, girlfriend, everybody at home, man, that's for them. This for this team. You just had a March Madness moment that will be forever in Colorado lore. How does that feel? It's amazing. It's amazing, but it's, it's just special to be out here and do it with this group, with this team. 
uh, the most wins in Colorado program history. Just have be under a coach like this, fan base like this, who comes out and travel, man, it means everything. You guys seem very poised. You gave up the lead. Yeah. They came all the way back. Clayton hits the three to yeah. tie it. Yeah. Where does that poise and composure come from? Uh, that's just mentally preparation. You know, we mentally prepare in practice. We go through this a uh, bunch of times in practice. You know, we have a competitive group. You know, so we're always in this situation in practice. Um, you know, we went through it with coach. But I think everybody out here is just capable. You know, we all have the mentality of just playing with poise when they're under pressure. All right, we'll see you on Sunday. Thank you, appreciate it. Chad, I want to bring you in here. Tad, to that point, Tad, when you call timeout, I saw no panic in there. Where is that from? Yeah, I think it's from a veteran group who, you know, we do time and score in practice a lot. Like KJ said, we, we, we went over that play um, multiple times this year. Haven't had to use it a lot, but, uh, you know, I felt like at halftime and then midway through the second half, I'm like, we got to score 100 to win this game. We score 102. <laughs> I mean, it was just one of those games. It's not, not the other night against Boise, you know, it was a defensive struggle tonight. It was an offensive uh, battle. You got to learn to win different ways in March. And uh, when you got a guy like KJ, our whole team played well. Our bench was terrific tonight. When they tied the game, though, as I said, you guys were composed, but what was it that you felt so confident that you had the personnel to win this game? And as you said, to score over 100 when you guys hadn't been doing that. Yeah, I mean, it, what gives you confidence is when you got good players and they know what they're supposed to do and then, you know, and they make plays. I mean, KJ made a play down the stretch. And players make plays, Andy, and especially in March. This is not a coach's game in March. This is a player's game, and that's why I'm so happy for our guys. All but one year, a first four team has won another game. Now you get a chance to play another game, and it's against Marquette on Sunday. How do you beat the Golden Eagles? I have no idea, but I'm going to try to find out in a very short period of time. I know uh, Shaka Smart's a hell of a coach. they got a hell of a program. But, uh, you know, i got a lot of confidence in our guys. It should be a lot of fun. Thanks, Ted. All right, thanks, Andy. Colorado wins it 102 to 100. Simpson, the game winning shot. And we'll be back to Indianapolis after this. Hey, 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 hey.